Hey guys, I hope I'm not late. No, nah, you're right on time, George. We're just waiting for Donnie now. Didn't Trump said he hated that nickname? Yeah, but he's not here right now. Speaking of him, have you guys heard anything? Is he not going to join today? Man, I wish having a Donald Free Day would be a dream day. Yeah, we really can't escape him, but it shouldn't be a problem if we started without him. Bet maybe today will be a good day. With two war criminals, nothing can go wrong. Shut, Shut up, Joe. Okay, Vance, she should be here. And if you're wrong, I'm taking away your zebra leather couch. Okay, Trump, you got this. I just hope Melania doesn't get pissed. Even if she does, I'll just increase her spending allowance. Hey there, future wife. I, I mean, hey there, my arch enemy. I know we're supposed to be debating soon, but I just wanted to show you my appreciation. So do you perhaps want to go on a date with me? You good? You know you can just speak and subtitles can pop up. What the fuck? I was just wondering, Obama, are we gonna play your brother's game? Your brother made a game, Barack? What? No, he didn't. Joe, what the hell is your old ass talking about? You know who I'm talking about? Your homeboy, Miles Morales. He got a game for himself. Are we gonna play that or are we going straight to Spider-Man 2? Joe, if this wasn't over a Discord call, I would have slapped you so hard you would be seeing your great-grandfather right about now. Oh, hey, Donald, you finally made it. Yeah, I bet you guys missed me, didn't you? Not really. I was actually happy for once. What about you, George? I mean, I'm still pretty neutral, so I guess I missed you. That's pretty gay, George. And here I thought the only zesty motherfucker here was Barack. Fuck you. You washed out ex-president. Hey, Donald, just what the hell took you so damn long? Was your greasy ass bankrupting another all-you-can-eat buffet? It's not my fault that the buffet couldn't keep up with my fast metabolism. Donald, the buffet ran out of food the first 10 minutes you arrived. They were lucky that I already had a meal beforehand. But if you must know why I'm so late, then I shall tell you. Look at Mr. Sophisticated over here. Shut it, George. I'll let you know that my grand plan of making Kamala fall for me was a complete bust. I'm more surprised we didn't hear this from the news with, and I quote, grab them by the pussy. It can feel nice sometimes. Joe, take your damn pills and fuck you, George. Well, he's not wrong, but I'm not gonna lie. I'm pretty rusty, so this gameplay is gonna be pretty ass. Not a very good impression for me, at least, but we'll see. Not a good impression? I bet we all thought that when you started an endless war with Iraq. Yeah, and we all realized that the president is a child-sniffing sick son of a bitch. I quit. Take this! What are you doing to me? Giving you a new perspective. I wonder what would happen if Martin decided to do that to me. He'll either become brain dead or go insane from the things he saw in that twisted head of yours. Probably both. If he read Donald's mind, he'll just automatically gain 400 pounds and start craving Big Macs 24-7. And if he read George's mind, he'll start targeting tall buildings and ride more planes. Fuck you with your yee ass haircut. He won't change much if he read Barry's mind. What makes you say that? I mean, he's already robbing and running away from the cops, so nothing really changes. Maybe he'll learn how to shoot a gun sideways. At this point, I'm becoming numb to these racist jokes you keep spouting. And no, Donald, you can't say the N-word. So-called superhero. You think you save people, but you just make it worse. This is your fault. My fault? He was under your protection. You really need two of those? <laughs> Stop! We need to brief Mr. Osborne now. Damn, bitch. If your security wasn't so ass, then maybe we could have actually succeeded. It was a garbage excuse is what it was. That shit was already being attacked and would have fallen quicker if Spider-Man didn't intervene. I hate it when people blame the hero, but don't realize that without them, they are cooked. And I also hate how game publishers push this bullshit girl power. Do they really expect us that she can land any punches on Spider-Man? Donald, the only reason why she was able to land a hit on Peter is because he always holds back. We see the crazy shit he can do, but do you expect that type of strength when he's fighting a random robber? Maybe if he's fighting one of your brothers, he'll stop holding back. Then you won't be bothered if some of my homeboys started a train on Melania. It's funny to assume that Melania would ever agree to that when she has me. She texted back and agreed. Wait, what? Yeah, Trump, everyone has taken a turn with Melania. Except me, she says I'm too creepy. 
Do you blame her? I'm just joking, Trump. Well, she did text back and agree, but I actually won't do it. Barry, I've been divorced twice now. A third one is not going to hurt at all. And I'll keep doing it until they finally realize who really has that big, long, fat Jew. Okay, we get it. You don't have to go into detail. Damn, devil's breath is gone. I should call MJ and Warner. This is Mary Jane Watson. Please leave a detailed message and I'll get back to you as soon as I can. What are you up to now, MJ? God damn it, just how many more times do we have to keep dealing with this shit? I don't know, Donald, but I'm getting tired of it. Wow, I know the Mary Jane parts are pretty slow, but it's like you guys get physically hurt by just playing this. George, I would rather reveal my search history to the whole world than to sit here and play as Mary Jane in a Spider-Man game. Yeah, that's pretty valid. You know, I like it when they focus on these stealth sections. I know Spider-Man is supposed to be beating up bad guys, but sometimes physical strength isn't everything. When hasn't beating up someone solved an issue? I Joe, I'm going to stop you right there. How about we change the subject? Have you guys been playing any games recently? I barely have any spare time to fully game. I'm trying to win an election here. I know your Cheeto dust ass at least plays some mobile games. He does actually, at the shootout at McDonald's, I saw Donald playing some Block Blast. Wait, isn't it that super addicting game that every person has been playing? Joe, we're not sponsored, so you don't have to do all that. Yeah, we're probably never going to because Donald here is a serious brand risk. And don't even say fake news, Trump. Your own handlers are trying to convince you to have a closed mic in the coming up debate. They don't know what they're talking about. The only reason why I had a closed mic with the slime ball over there was because he was my friend and I decided to go easy on him. Really, Donald? That's so kind of you. Joe, do you actually believe that? Never mind what Joe believes. Let's just go back to the question. I've been playing Honkai Impact the third. What about you, George? Wait, let me guess, flight simulator with the Twin Towers add-on. Keep talking and soon a plane is gonna crash right onto Trump Tower. Just ignore him, but what games do you play, George? Well, I mostly play MMOs, but lately I've been playing Dying Light and Dying Light 2, which might be the best zombie game to ever release. Well, not so much the second one, but definitely the first one. Is that why this video came out a lot later than what it was supposed to? Yeah, sorry about that, guys. What about you, Barack? Any other games you play? Well, besides Spider-Man and Batman, I usually just play custom COD Zombies maps. I'm really excited for Black Ops 6. Lee's getting away. Finally. Sorry I'm late. It's kind of my thing. Oh man, I just hope that big booty alien with a tight red-skinned costume doesn't come and starts choking. Okay, Joe, that's enough. For a second, I thought you were talking about the train scene, but I was clearly very wrong. What train scene? There was no train scene in Fortnite. Did I just hear that correctly? What are you guys talking about? Joe, I'm so disappointed right now. I'll finish this up, and then I'm heading to buy some missiles so I can drone strike some Middle Eastern civilians. Maybe that will cheer me up. Come on, man. No brakes? No problem. worked last time. Yuri, they still doing construction on 42nd and 1st? Streets closed for another month. Why? <laughs> Next stop, prison. All right, this is about it. See you guys next time. Oh, and Donald, you should probably go check on Mar-a-Lago. Barack, what did you do? You should probably go check it out. Damn, you're really upset. Come on, Barry, you know I was just joking. I guess I should go now. See you next time, George.